within the, every cell is a very important fluid called the cytoplasm. Now, the cytoplasm is a jelly-like substance that's contained inside of that cell membrane. It's like the workspace in a factory where each person does their particular job. The cytoplasm supports and protects structures called organelles. You see several of them down in here, and we'll talk more about them later. An organelle is a specialized structure within a cell that performs a particular function. It's also in the cytoplasm where the cell's building materials are made and stored. The nucleus is the next thing you'll see. If you were to view cells under a microscope like we did earlier, the nucleus would probably be one of the first things that you would see. The nucleus is like the manager of an ice cream factory. The factory manager oversees the worker and tells them what job to do and what tasks need to be completed in order to produce the ice cream. Like a manager, the nucleus is known as the control center of the cell and it contains DNA. Now DNA is short for deoxyribonucleic acid. It's a nucleic acid that is the genetic material which is passed from parent to offspring. This nucleic acid also contains a set of instructions that tell cells how to function. That's why the nucleus is called the control center of the cell.